I'm Neil Chu Hong, uh, Director of the Software Sustainability Institute, and on behalf of the steering committee, um, on behalf of DANS, the Data Archive and Network Services, the Netherlands eScience Centre and the Software Sustainability Institute, welcome to this workshop on software sus sustainable software sustainability. Um, by the end of this, we'll all remember exactly which order to put the three S's in this workshop. Um, our organisations all support WAS because we believe that bringing people together from different communities to discuss the topic of software sustainability will help us all make provisions for the long term of software uh, and improve the impact that each of us is having. So next slide, please, Shweb. Uh, WAS has always been a series of international workshops. The first one was held in Berlin in 2015, organized by the Knowledge Exchange Group. And then subsequently we've had workshops every two years in 2017 and 2019 in The Hague, and now in 2021 virtually. We've explored topics that, has, that have covered a wide range of themes. Um, and WAS has always had a broad scope and audience, ranging from research organizations to cultural her heritage or institutions, all coming together to discuss the sustainability of software and its associated practices. Next slide, please, Shreve. So there are four goals of WAS, um, cross-pollination of ideas, identifying key issues, informing policymakers and funders, and working out how we sustain software sustainability. These goals are aimed at ensuring that we collectively advance our practice. And I think it's really interesting coming together this year in 2021, because we're at a real turning point for the way that society considers the role of software. We've seen the recognition of software in recommendations from the OECD on access to research data and from UNESCO on open science and as part of cultural heritage. We've also seen the establishment of the next framework for the European Open Science Cloud and the establishment of the Research Software Alliance. So all of these things together show a shift in the way that uh, research software, um, software um, being used in um, cultural and heritage applications are all uh, being considered alongside data and alongside other sorts of policies in the world that we inhabit. So there's never been a better time for us to work together to understand all of the different issues, propose the different solutions um, and drive forward different aspects of software sustainability. So as I said, on behalf of the steering committee, on behalf of my um, colleagues, um, Joris and uh, Peter, I hope you have a great workshop and I hope to hear all about your work and ideas in all of the sessions to come. Thanks and I'll hand back over to Shoei.